about hey guys. To enjoy the ride. Because I'm vlogging. Okay, well, I'm going to vlog too. We're not supposed to just be bored. Hey, y'all. That's not What's vlogging. Up? Dana. So, we're on our way to the airport. Ma, say hello. Hey, you have to turn around. My friend's mom. She's taking on her makeup. It's freaking like 4 o'clock in the morning. I just freaking listen. I want to take you guys on this journey with me. Are you so, talking like you're from LA? Because I am. She's <laughs> you know. So, stay tuned. Okay. Like, they have like the bottle ones in here because they're still not that expensive. The bottom ones are oh, smoothies. Yeah. Okay, so but they don't have Apple Pay. We're finally, and I didn't even download Cash App on my trap phone. Can you download it? Or so we're um. They don't have it. No. We're at um. We're like already in or whatever, like through TSA or whatever. We we're sitting at our boarding, whatever. Our gate. Yeah, our gate. Um. But I'm hungry. So I cannot eat no big and toasted. I said split it. No. She's trying I'm gonna die yet. This is your last fun meal. No. I, I no, my last fun meal is my last meal of the day. You know I can't eat after a certain time. I don't, I don't think I told y'all but this is my um BBL. Law. Um. So you know I'm getting like that. And um, I put in my booty. We're going to Miami. So we're about to catch a flight to um for Lauderdale and then get a rental car or whatever and then go straight to the doctor's office for my pre-op. Um, this is also my mom's birthday weekend, so it's like a birthday surgery walk. Um, this is Kenya's first time on a, oh, I didn't introduce her. This is my cousin, Kenya. She also does YouTube. Um, I put her link in my bio. She does hair on her YouTube channel. If y'all live in a DMV area, you know, book her. Kenya's first time on a plane. Are you scared? No. Are you nervous? No, actually not anymore. I'm not even nervous about my surgery. I would get into it. Checked into the hotel. 
Um, I am squared. My makeup's like messed up. Sorry. I'm squared away. I got my garments. Um, I saw all the like the the nurse and stuff, and she said everything was good. So now we're about to go get some food because they told me I can't eat or drink anything eight hours before surgery. So I'm trying to get my last little meal. And I didn't eat nothing yet today. All I had was that smoothie, which I saw earlier. Oh, I'm going to take these guys so long. But I'm excited for tomorrow. I don't know why she's going me. She knows she will talk like this. I don't yeah, talk I'm, like I'm, that. I'm in my surgery or whatever. Y'all already know. I'm about to be snatched. <laughs> I'm about to be torched. I don't talk like that. I'm about to have a badonka die. Oh, yeah. Cause my hair looks a mess. She is going to me good. I remember this is my birthday trip. She just keep asking for pictures upon pictures upon pictures. I got my photographer or something. We're going to like a food truck place. It stinks. It looks pretty torch on Instagram. So I hope it tastes torch. The scenery is like really nice. Like if I lived here, I would come down here, get dressed and take pictures like every day. But a lot of these buildings are like abandoned. Like this is like an abandoned hotel. So this is my food. I got jerk um, macaroni and cheese. She got jerk pasta, chicken pasta. And my mom got lobster macaroni and cheese. This is my last meal. This is the piggin outest I've eaten in like a month. Um, let's see how it tastes. Uh, let me try to put it on Instagram. A bite. Let's taste it. Very, very cheesy. Yeah. It's very, very you try to do it? No, I'm down. Watch it a lot. Oh, okay. Okay. Um, it's Susie Kiss. S U S I E. And then Kiss. It's actually kind of good. I don't even really like the cheese that much. So we're back in the hotel room. As you see, I took my lashes off because that was just too much. I don't have the energy to take my makeup off though. But I'm about to take a nap because I'm just exhausted. I only got like two hours of sleep last night. And then I slept a little bit on a plane. But I just ate, so like I'm really, really tired now. It's like five something. So I probably take a nap until like seven. Maybe go to the pool for like an hour. And then we might go on to South Beach. We ended up not going to South Beach for food. We just went to a food truck. Okay. So it's the day of surgery. Um, we're about to leave out the room or whatever. I still have makeup on my face and I don't know how. I don't have makeup wipes, but I was scrubbing my face. Like, popcorn. Um, we're probably going to be running late because my mom run li runs late to everything. She runs late for everything. Yeah, it's like 7 o'clock in the morning. We have to be, it's actually 7.40. We have to be there by 8. It's 20 minutes away. Um, I don't really feel like doing nothing to my hair. 
I'm excited. A little bit nervous. A little, little, little bit nervous. Say hi to the pool. Okay, so we're in the car. I look very ashy. You want some lotion? It said don't put on lotion. Oh, okay. Um, how do you feel? Mm, I'm not nervous if you're not. I'm confident. Can I just want them to get into them flanks. <laughs> yeah, still you dig into those flanks. If they don't do nothing else, that's what they need to do. Right? Okay. Um, I don't think I'm nervous. I probably won't get nervous until like You're not gonna be oh I'm if you would have stayed up last night, you would have been so sick. Take the exit onto FL nine eighty five south of North. I'm tired now though. What did they say? Six point one miles take south. Northwest 107. Um, yeah, I'm not really nervous. I probably won't get nervous until like it's time for the Wait, are we staying anesthesia. The place the probably, and then once she gets to recover, yeah. But if she gotta wait, when she get there, we don't gotta stay. We'll come back. I do have to wait. I'm still not nervous. I'm, it's getting like crunch time, but it still hasn't hit me. Y'all, yeah, I've been like waiting for this to have a butt my whole life. Like, I'm just excited. I'm getting so irritated. I've been here since 8.30. The doctor came to see me probably at like 10. It's, it's what, 11.30? And I'm still waiting. They told me the anesthesiologist would be here in a second, like an hour ago. Like, I'm just literally, I'm ready to go back. I just need that. And I've taken a nap and everything, and they're still not ready my mom has met new friends left took them to the store but they keep coming in here hey y'all i don't even think i showed y'all my bef i mean my before or my after <clears throat> um i've been home for i mean at the hotel for like five hours my camera was just dead I don't feel bad at all. Like, I still haven't taken any pain medicine or anything. <clears throat> um, I'm bleeding a lot. I didn't get a drain. I'm about to show y'all my body and how much blood is on me. <clears throat> um, my boobs are outside. But I'm very bloody. <clears throat> um... I literally had no butt at first. Like none at all. Um, I don't really like how my faha fits. Because I'm already, I know a little bit about the surgery life. I feel like my faha is too big. It's not the proper fit. But my mom said once they add the board and stuff tomorrow, it should fit better. And she told me to get, contact the people to get measured for my, um, stage two. <clears throat> Which is gonna be tighter. Um, I probably should have told him. So, um, I met my follow up. Of course, Kay is with me. My hey, mom. It's freezing in here though. Um, I really don't feel bad at all. <laughs> I think we're going out to eat or something tonight, so you know, I'm finna get cute. The only thing is, I'm bleeding like hardcore, hard hardcore. Like I keep bleeding up the sheets. Hmm. Mhm. Mm oh, the clip yesterday cut off. I don't even remember what I was saying. <laughs> so yesterday I was saying that I probably should tell the doctor that I wanted a big, big butt. Um, and then let it like small and back down, but 
um after a while it does get bigger like fluffier so i should be fine <clears throat> i just don't know how long that'll take hopefully it'll start fluffing up by next month but my tongue is like numb like the hair on my tongue i can't feel it at all i cut my lip yesterday during surgery but it's not really bothering me <clears throat> my tongue is numb Hopefully we don't be in here all day because I don't have time. What time is it? It's 9.24. It's 9.24, so I had to be here between 9 and 12. I tried to get here as early as possible because the last time I got here at like 11.30, I was here till like 2. And I just don't have time for that. We have to go to Target. <clears throat> My mom's best friend said um, to get like some rubber sheets or something since I keep bleeding up the place. But, I feel, Baby, yeah. Come with me. Okay. Seven. Yeah. Okay. Drink a lot of fluid. A little more gallon to two gallons of fluid daily. Okay. You can eat regular. Okay. And not sitting down or laying down in your butt for at least minimum three weeks. Three? Okay. Yeah, from three to that. six weeks. Okay. You can use the video page. All right. Okay. Yeah, because I'm in school, so I was supposed to, I'm going back to school next week. Mm -hmm. She put the boards. Where do we put them? The boards. This one goes in the back. That one goes in the back. Like we use the triangle. Yeah. You do okay. the same thing. And then you're gonna need three of this. Okay. So one on the front and then on the side. And this on each side. Okay. And then the hard board goes. Okay. Okay. So she needs two boards. And yeah, yeah another the, one. The, that's for the back. Okay. okay. You so get a one for the front. One that is round or well, depends what shape they have it. Uh -huh. And you put it on the front. Okay. Okay. That's it? Yeah. So you're going in Saturday? Yeah, probably. Between 9 and 12. Yeah, probably coming 9 to Saturday. Okay. Thank you. See you Saturday, okay? This is how I have to sit in the car, laying down. I look super dumb thick like this. I said I look super dumb thick like this. Uh-huh. look better? Okay. 
is very important. Very, very important. Lift your belly. And lift, 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 lift. I would rather use the lipophone and belly board, two pieces. Okay. okay, so tomorrow when you have the other, perfect. Take it for the, the, the your waist. But for today, it's much better. Why? One, if you have some fluid, you want to drink a lot. Mm -hmm. And second, your belly is going to be a lot of flutter for tomorrow. Okay. Okay? Of course, for a boy, a little mess, if you have some pad, a um, maxi pad, you can put it here because you're gonna leak it a lot. Hey y'all. <clears throat> so as y'all can see from the last clip, I got a massage. That's supposed to help like me drain my fluids out and stuff. And I was supposed to be going to the mall, but I'm like freaking leaking everywhere. I think it's coming from getting the massage. Like I'm not in pain or anything. My body is bruised, but <clears throat> I'm just leaking blood everywhere. <clears throat> so, um, we're going to dinner around 8 o'clock. It's 4 o'clock now, so I'm about to just like take a quick little nap and then get up and get ready. Um, I was about to say something else. I forgot. <coughs> I just really don't know. Like, I just really started leaking. Hell out. Oh, this is what I was about to say. Um, you're supposed to wear, like, foams and boards and stuff to help you. I guess it's another way to compress. So we don't did. Don't buy it from your doctor. Yeah, I wouldn't recommend getting it from the surgery place. Because the foams at the surgery place were, like, $20 a piece. And I want to say the board was $40. So I bought two foams. And a board, so that probably would have been like eighty dollars at the doctor's office. But we went to a um, Baja place right in the same shopping center, and I got everything for forty dollars. <clears throat> so right now I have that in, so I probably look a little boxy. So it's like a foam and a board right here, a foam here, a foam here, and a board in the back. <clears throat> the um, doctor told me to drink. And not the doctor, one of the nurses told me to drink a gallon of water a day. So, <clears throat> I've been doing that. My throat is a little bit raspy from when they, what is it called, intubate? When they intubated me, whatever. But, we're probably about to eat something, watch a movie, take a nap until dinner. Tomorrow's my mom's birthday, so we're going <clears throat> to, like, brunch kind of lunch. And then we're supposed to be going on a boat ride. And I we were supposed to be going to the club, but I probably can't make it to the club. So when they went to the mall to find me something to wear for tomorrow. I didn't really bring any clothes here because I wouldn't really... Well, they don't even know my size. This dress is an extra large, and it's... But, um, so they went to go find me an outfit for that. I just wanted to come back and check in before my nap. I'm about to take this dress off and just sleep naked. Well, not naked. I'm going to sleep in my faha. My mom literally just washed this joint and it's already... I'm going to sit y'all down. Is my mom going to out? My mom just came from the laundromat and it's already bloody. But I look swollen because these are the boards. Oh, there's one right here too. <coughs> My butt looks so much bigger without the fall on. But I'm satisfied with my results. I know I look like yesterday, but I'm clean, I promise. We're back at the doctor. This is my last appointment <coughs> because I leave tomorrow. And of course, look, cans with me. She had a different outfit today. Uh, I had a really bad last night. Well, that was, that was like five o'clock this morning. My mom said she should have recorded, but I was like crying and stuff. 
but I don't know it's just I'm bruised and it everything hurts but I'm getting another massage today when we get back to the room <clears throat> I smell like a hospital and it's like really pissing me off on a whole nother level I just don't want to smell like this anymore um I have like some foam boards and stuff in. I took those other boards out because that's what was hurting me last night. Um, I know this vlog is like so choppy probably, but today's my mom's birthday. They got me an outfit yesterday, so when I leave here, I'm going to eat something so I can take my medicine get my massage and then we're going to get dressed I have to do my makeup my mom's makeup and we have to try to fix my hair because it's like it needs to be washed but I don't know I'm going to wash it but yeah just trying to keep you guys a little updated because I was pretty I was big um I weighed 224 um I was pretty big. I had a lot of stretch marks. But now I feel like I've gotten really small. Um, the masseuse said um, my stomach got yeah, really, really flat. Yesterday you couldn't see my vagina and today you came. Um, the doctor's office told me I need to get seven more massages. So I need to get one tomorrow. and Well, up until next Friday. So I'm going to be doing that. And that will help me get flatter. Like, the massages, as you can see, is just the liquid getting pushed out of me. So, I mean, I'm on my way to road to recovery. And I know a key to being flat is uh, wearing your fall hot 24-7. But my mom just went to go wash mine because since I don't have a drain, it just keeps getting bloody and bloody and bloody. So... They went to go wash my faha, and then we're gonna um, go get. I mean, we're gonna get dressed and stuff. I think I'm about to take another small nap, and then get up and take a shower and do my hair and makeup to get ready to go out for the night. I actually kind of feel better. Earlier, I just felt so down and pain and pain, but I think now that I have that faha off, I feel a lot better. Like a lot, a lot better. I just took a ibuprofen, whatever. I don't know how to say that. Um, the masseuse says she prefers those better than the Percocets. So, I just took one of those. And I just really need to get myself together because I've been looking ugly since I got here. So, I'll be back when I look a little more put together. Look at this story. Okay, so, it's the end of the night, kind of. Um... We went out earlier, but I wasn't feeling good, so I didn't walk. But we're on our way to um, a boat party mm -hmm. type thing. You don't have no stuff. I just watched it. Oh, um, it's like a hip hop boat ride, so. I already put the um, address in from when you get Yeah. Somewhere. I'm feeling a bit better. Ma. You don't want this game, right? Ma, it's your birthday. Say hello to the vlog. I'll say it. Um, this game, what is it? Boulevard. Yeah. What's so, your phone I'll number? I'll be back later. But I didn't start it. I'm like extremely uncomfortable. 
I cannot walk for distances. I need to take my hair out. But my mom went to go get the car and Kenya went to go get a smoothie or something. So I'm waiting on her. And I'm just sitting here. Um, I have like this little bobby pillow. So that's what I'm using to sit on. I'm just, I don't know if Kenya knows that I stopped too, so I'm just trying to make sure she doesn't leave me. The tip of my tongue is still numb from surgery, and I just, I don't really know what's going on with that. <clears throat> that hurts. Um, I still don't feel good. I don't really know what's going on. I don't know if it's like the bruises are catching up with me and I kind of wasn't trying to take a lot of medicine. So, I'm, I think I only took like one painkiller today. So, yeah. So, finally done my makeup. I just have on a little simple black dress. I probably look big right now because I have on foams and stuff. But I don't know what we about to do, but I'll just be back with me. We're at the airport. I don't know if I know the line. Um, I'm in a wheelchair. Kenya. Kenya's my escort. Um, I can't really walk that fast, so I can't even walk for a period. So. You know, chilling in the airport. So we get to go through check fast to her because she's my escort and I can't really walk. So we're just gonna wait for my mom and Tom to come through after. I'm freaking I'm bleeding a lot. But I got to do TSA. Just waiting for Kenya to finish getting her stuff. I'm so uncomfortable right now. I just want to get back on my knees. I don't really like sitting on my butt. It hurts once I stand up. But getting some Is we supposed to be in B? That's what I was thinking. So we're landed, we're back in Maryland, and we can't find the car. So we're riding back with my mom's best friend, and she swears that she parked one place, and we've been standing here, and the car's not here. So now she's in like the car, <clears throat> with the airport people riding around trying to find her car, and we're just standing here looking. My mom has work at 7. It's 5. We're in Baltimore. I gotta go to work in D.C. She has to go to work in D.C. But she still has to get her car from home. That's probably like 45 minutes away. Um, I almost died on the airplane. But... Overall, I'm doing pretty good. My mom is mad because I keep crying. But it's just so uncomfortable. Oh, I need it. Oh, my stomach's like so hard. Who? Who? I keep leaking just like right here. Just in this one area. Area. Hmm? Okay, I get, when I eat, um, I get full really fast, but then 
Like two hours later, I'd be hungry again. I don't really know what's that about. But I'm almost done taking my antibiotics. I just have three more to take today. And then I'm done. But I feel pretty good to be getting back to my daily life. I think that'll help me. Healing wise. What? Tab has lost. Some said you alright. <laughs> I said yeah. Where was the car? It looks just like this, but it's the other side. She was all the way I down mean, there. So I know. I hope so. Cause the new skin comes from the old. She got sunburn while we were in. Um... Yes, I did. Yeah. Oh, I never. Yes, I, I never do, introduced. And gentlemen, I'm... This is Tom, my mom's hey. best friend. <laughs> yes, I'm sunburned really, really bad. I lost the car. We saw you riding around with mine, your suitcase. Yes, yeah, riding around in people's vehicles. <laughs> so you do what you gotta do, baby. I'm, you usually never have nothing in your trunk. This is all fashion show shit. What? Like H1 or whatever. Oh, good idea. I'll do that from now on. Can that sit in the middle of y'all? She can't fit in the front door? Uh, that's just border. I still look crazy, but... Um... Yesterday was my first night home. Um... It went pretty well. I just got hungry, really hungry in the middle of the night, so I was just waiting on that, but... Um, I'm not really leaking anymore and I feel much better. I had a client this morning. I did my client with no problem. So overall, I think I'm off to a good start being home. I think I just needed to be home to feel a little better. But this is going to be the end of this vlog. Um, I'm going to of course do updates and stuff. But that's it for this vlog. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Make sure you subscribe.